Hey guys, welcome back to the Aerosol Clean channel and today I am reviewing another wig for you guys and I am super duper excited to do this review and today we are working with Eula Hair. They kindly provided us with a 5x5 HD closure wig and it is body weight of 18 inches. That is cute. Look at the wig. And the pack it came it. with lashes and also a rat's hair comb. But today it's not going to be a regular schmegula video. I'm going to be doing the far spray prank on my victim sitting on this chair and she does not know what I'm about to prank him. So this is going to be funny. Add more. Do you think it stinks? It stinks, doesn't it? Mm -mm. You add more like um, am I bugging? It smells. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. It smells. Not too much. Just a bit. But it smells a bit. And no, I'm saying don't add too much. Oh. Show them how you add it. Oh yeah. This is. It stinks. Stop. Stop fighting when I'm doing it. It's your not hair. me. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Go. No, it's not. It stinks. stinks. It's you. I, I can spend it. I promise you, I think I it's you. You, I you think stink. It's you. Okay, let's start with the hair. I don't have time. Smell. <sighs> it smells again. Stop. It's you. Can we start? Yes, we can start. You stink. Stop saying that because I, I don't smell it. What is it? Because it's you. It's yourself. You're used to that smell. I know what I smell. Move. I don't want I don't want you to do my hair anymore. Huh? I don't want you to do my hair anymore. Turn around and stop. You smell. Stop. I seriously don't know what you're talking about. No, I, I well, you should know. Anyways, back to the voiceover, I use the Wonder Lace Bond Glue and I apply it right on the edges beneath the wig cap so that I can glue my lace. So with the right tail comb, I kind of smothered it down so that it kind of smoothed out because you don't want no bumpy glue. You want your lace to look as perfect and as neat as possible. So the glue needs to be neat too. Kind of smother it super easy. And then I moved on to blow drying the glue. I prefer my blow dry temperature to low to medium heat, depending on how you feel, because I don't want any residue like glue residue to stay. And then I went back to pranking my victim. Don't do my hair, you smell. Go away, no, you do it. Smell. Can you stop? No, I'm not gonna stop. Don't touch my hair, I'm leaving. No, you no. gotta stop. No, I'm not gonna stop, you smell so bad. Okay, do it by yourself. No, I'm going, it smells, I can't breathe. It's you. I cannot it's breathe, you. it's you. No, it's you. Who's recording, can I you stop? I don't care, well, we're gonna stop recording. Go, I'm not, get on. No, I'm not. Oh, I smell it. <sighs> oh, It's you. It's you. Hmm. No, you're not doing my hair. Can you stop? No. You stink. Cool. Stop, come what? back. Wait, I thought you said bye. Stop. Stop, just stop fighting. No, please, can you stop fighting? Please. How can I stop fighting when I'm not please, fighting? Please, just stop. I'm tired, please. My hair. <laughs> oh my gosh! I said stop! What? I'm not doing my hair anymore, you stink! Oh my gosh! I can't, I'm about to gag. <coughs> no, you stink. I can't. Can you stop? Come back here, or you're not getting your head on. I don't want to get my hair done anymore. Stop! Cool, bye. I'm joking. No, we're not joking. I'm joking, it's that. Stop! <laughs> you're not funny. <laughs> you're not funny. This one's at me. Don't, no, stop! <laughs> Guys, I got her again. I saw that on TikTok, so I wanted to try it. Okay. And you? Just <laughs> do my hair now, please. Stop farting or doing whatever you're doing. <laughs> I'm not farting. Okay. Yeah, it's the spray. Okay. Anyways, we're back. That was an incredible prank. It was actually pretty funny, but let's move on to the hair again with the same Wonder Lace glue. Guys, you can use whatever glue you want to use. I did put a second layer on the same spot that I put the first layer in, and with the right comb again, I'm going to smother it, and again, blow dry it. Low to medium heat is preferred. I did not, I don't like to like put hot hot heat on my scalp or the edges of my hair because it's painful but now next thing I'm going to do is to adjust the wig I want to like not have the wig right on my forehead 
And that is simply because I want to maintain a natural look to my hair. I don't want my hair to look like I'm wearing a wig. I feel like that's like the main goal of like wearing a wig. You want it to look as natural as possible because you're spending all that money for your hair to just look like a wig. Like I know it's a wig, but like don't make it look like a wig. Anyways, we want to melt the lace. That's literally what I'm trying to say. Let's just put this into words and make this simple. Next thing with the Wonder Spray. I love the Wonder products because they're really good. But yes, with the Wonder Spray, I'm going to spray the lace and that is going to maintain a very melted look which is the goal of this install okay with the rat comb we're going to comb the hair back we don't want any of the hairs to interrupt the lace this is gonna allow us to achieve the melted lace look without any like problems or interruptions now now with a lace fusible band we are going to tie the lace and oh uh, you might want to do it a little bit tight because like it, it works it hurts a little bit but the tighter the better but not so tight and i'm gonna move on to straightening the hair i was debating to like either leave the like waves or just like straighten the hair the waves are beautiful guys i'm not even gonna lie and i wish i kept the wave but i did decide to just straighten the hair um i don't know if i regret doing that because if you guys can see the difference between the wave and the straightened hair i think i like the waves a little more better just because it just looks nicer i don't know maybe maybe i'm wrong but towards the end you guys are going to see the difference and you guys can decide if i should have kept the wave or should have straightened my hair but as you can see now i'm going to cut the lace and that's like the most important bit of the video to me cutting the lace is like um you'll rather die you know if you do not cut the lace properly then um yeah you can say bye bye to the wig because i don't think you can reinstall the wig unless you can fix it but like i don't think you can fix that okay i decided to use scissors instead of a razor simply because i felt confident more like comfortable using scissors uh but i know razors are so much easier so i regret that choice um uh, next time i think i'm going to just stick to razors but um using scissors is not as bad anyways you just have to be like a pro like me to use them <laughs> but uh, no i'm joking guys but you can use scissors if you feel comfortable with using scissors but like yeah again we're gonna tie the hair the tighter the better but not too tight i'm gonna leave it on for like five to ten minutes five minutes minimum ten minutes max but yeah five to ten minutes or as soon as i'm done like styling my hair so it, it probably like a little bit longer than that but quick tip before you do actually um tie your hair you might want to make sure that the glue is just a little bit dry like if it's not as dry it might stick to the headband and then it might like cause a problem like with like flakiness and it might lift the lace a little bit and you don't want that to happen because it's gonna take longer than it should it's just like so difficult anyways i moved on with the hot comb and of course i need to flatten the hair the hair needs to be flat okay i don't want no i don't want to wear a helmet okay i want to wear a wig not a helmet we're not doing that so we're using the hot comb and of course during the process i was adjusting the back of my hair making sure that everything was good and you know it was pretty easy to like lay it flat so yeah i took off the headband because i couldn't bear the pain it was too painful and also it was ready okay it exceeded the 10 minute mark so yeah, I took it off and I started to adjust the hair a little bit too with the hot comb and I actually like it. Like it looks so pretty. Do you guys agree? I feel like I should have probably straightened it a little bit more but it just looks so long because the hair is like really wavy. It doesn't straighten properly. So I think if you guys get the wig, do not straighten it unless you're going to like section parts. And dedicate a lot of time trying to straighten every inch and every bit of the hair because it does get super wavy after like a little bit of time so I would suggest to, to just leave it it looks better wavy. I don't know why I straightened it I should have left it but you guys get to still decide what you think but it still looks really nice so I'm not even like disappointed at all so I learned my lesson yeah I learned my lesson 
If I do reinstall the hair after I wash it, I'm definitely gonna leave the hair with like its own curl pattern. I'm not gonna like straighten it ever. So guys, I was super excited to do the reveal because I wanted you guys to see what it looks like. But unfortunately, the camera stopped recording so I kind of had to do a last minute reveal like after. I realized it did not record and after I'm gonna change everything but it still looks super cute and I love the hair guys it did come out a little bit wavy it wasn't like super straight so it adds to the natural look and I love 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 it this is the definition of natural the details about the hair will be in the description box below thank you guys so much for watching and I'm out Bye. Touch. Can you play that again? What you do? 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 What you do?